As my world, as Gideon world and Maven world started to cross over, we realised that we had quite a lot more in common than we previously thought. But he's devoted his life to the single most important thing for Maven, which is dance. And um, a sort of mirror image of that is, I've been the same with music. We have really parallel experiences with going really deep into the underworld of London nightlife and the, you know, the illegal side of, um, of uh, raids and squat parties and nightclubbing and after hours. And um, so we, we're really able to you know, catch each other's eye when it comes to referring to that kind of heightened experience, that kind of hedonism and feeling that alive, you know. The level of expertise and talent surrounding Maven on this show is incredible. I've previously had the experience in my life of inviting other people into my ecosystem, um, which I like to think is of a similar calibre to Maven's, but I've never had it the other way around. So it's been, it's been wild actually walking into um, this team. The people, kind of my crew who are coming to this show, my friends, the people related to um, the clubs and the festivals and the record labels and the protest sound systems and the sort of the alternative sort of countercultural queer network here in London. I think that when they experience this, they will f kind of feel at home as well. They'll see themselves in this story because this story is set in the shadow of a giant sound system in a warehouse and it's about queer love on the dance floor. So there aren't very many things that are authentically about that. Something that I, that I, that I love about this project is the fact that um, we didn't have any money, we didn't have a venue, we didn't have a crew, we were not well funded, and it was a collaborative group effort to pull something together. The ecosystem, the, the family of um, kind of queer London who are involved in this project have been incredibly generous. The calls, the Adonis crew, the iAudio support the project. So it's a product of the love and support of the community that the show is actually about. I think uh, it has gifted the project of a, um, a really raw energy, a visceral energy that you will see in the work and hear in the music.